How's it going? How's it going, puppy? You ready for an exciting day? Are you excited for today? I'll take that as a yes. Shee <laughs> Well, folks, welcome back to the episode of Fisher Flare. Today, we've got a very special video. But before that happens, look, Millie's trying to get in the shot here. Hey, how's it going, buddy? You just, you gotta be on camera, huh? At all times, you gotta be on camera. Anyways, hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We've got an exciting video planned, but before we do that, we do have a sponsor for today's video, and that sponsor is Crystal Born. Crystal Born was just released and is the most impressive RPG game on your phone. Crystal Born is now available for iOS and Android. You can fight unique bosses, collect exclusive heroes, and PvP with your friends from around the world with fully animated attacks and stunning visual effects in breathtaking arenas. And the best part is, it's totally free to download. Also, Crystal Born is a featured top new game on the Apple App Store. So if you guys are interested in downloading Crystal Born, it'll be linked down below in the description down below. Go click it, go check it out, go download. We are gonna be playing a couple games real quick before this video gets started. So sit back, relax, and stay tuned. All right, we're getting the game fired up here on the phone here. Like I said, we're gonna play a game here to show you guys a little bit more about it. Um, but first things first, just get right into it, get right into the battle, into the juicy stuff that you guys want. So, go ahead and click battle. I'm gonna go PvP Arena, and uh, I've, still, I've done two out of the three of the arenas and done four out of five of the underground. So we're gonna go ahead and finish off the arena here. Um, and Bruno, Bruno, you know what, you're just, you're gonna go down. I don't know how to pronounce your name, but you're going down. So, you can see my team, I've got three guys there. My, my all-time favorite is for sure Cyclone. He's an absolute freaking beast. Um, so let's see. This will be interesting. We'll see if I can I can take this guy down. He he was really high ranked. Um, but let's go ahead and get in there. Boom! Yeah, there you go. All right, took that one out. Keep going. Yep, keep going. All right, now it's their turn. This should be it. Oh, wow. All right, it hit me good. Not going to lie, that one hurt. All right, okay, now it's my turn. Going back at it. That was a brutal... Br oh, there you go, Cyclone. There you go. All right, one more. Boom! We got one down, folks. Here we go. Oh, oh. Okay, it's my turn. Here we go, firing back. Firing back on him. Come on, Cyclone. Oh, God. he almost got him, he almost got him. One more. We got him, we got two. We got two down, okay? All right, we got two to go. All right, back to my turn here. Yep, come on. Come on, Cyclone, finish her off. Oh, we're close, we're close, Zora. Zora's got it, does Zora have it? Oh, it's gonna be close. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Cyclone, Cyclone, it's a 2v2 right now, buddy. Come on, finish her off, yes! Atta boy, Cyclone. Freaking beast out here. Come on, we got one more. We got one more. We can do this. We can do this. Come on, Zora, finish him off. Done. Freaking done. Killed the game. Victory. Shout out to Zora and Cyclone for coming in clutch with the dub, and I got some milestone prizes and a bunch of other fun stuff. Well, there you have it, folks. You saw me. I took down the enemy. Easy peasy, squash him. But I just showed like a smidget, just like a little highlight reel of what all of Crystal Born has to offer. So if any of this interests you at all, click the link down below. Go download it. It is entirely free. A couple other things you can do. You can join a guild. You can rank up your heroes, infuse their abilities, and upgrade all the gear. There's tons of other stuff. Like I said, it'll be linked down below. If any of this interests you at all, go click the link down below. Go sign up. Like I said, it is entirely free. Huge thanks to MZ for sponsoring today's video. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be able to do what I do every single day. As you guys know, YouTube likes to demonetize some of my videos. Kind of makes it tough here and there to do certain videos like coyote hunting and stuff like that. And having these sponsors come in really helps me out and helps me do what I do every single day and provide you guys with videos that you guys enjoy every single day. So without further ado, let's get into today's episode. You guys stay tuned. Shoo! Well, folks, we are now at the Asian market. That's literally what this place is called, the Asian market. So we're gonna be giving it a dangle in here. This is where we bought the whole lobsters. Now, we're not sure exactly what we're gonna be cooking, um, but we got, look at these fresh kicks, Rick. Is it she this got season, this season. She, not that fresh. She, she, the puddle. Yeah, I would not do that. Actually, you do. What's that? What's the challenge that goes around on the oh, the, thing the, the TikTok thing? Oh, where you, oh yeah, like, where you have to dip your feet in it. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> what is this fit? You got ice fishing oh, bibs, yeah. a little sticker action. You're ready. You've never been to the Asian market. You haven't been to this one either. Last time we were here, we got lobster. We are going to be going to Walmart, of course. You can't come here without going to Walmart. So we're gonna basically we're gonna get the main course here. We decided. You guys enjoyed the Wal or the Walmart lobster video, where basically we just cooked food and had a kind of a mukbang, which we'll probably have today. And there was actually a viewer. I'll uh, I'll pull up his Instagram in a bit and talk to you about it. But he sent me a DM after we posted the video. He's like, dude, you guys, these are all the things you guys need to buy and try. So we'll go through his list and probably buy some of those items. 
and see what see what we got. See what we can buy, see what you guys might enjoy. Um, us eat mainly we gotta find something here that Hook Daddy will will eat and throw up, hopefully. Dude, this place slaps. Are you kidding me? This okay, don't say we could probably get some fire candy here. What <laughs> he says we could probably get fire candy. And I apologize if the audio sucks in this video. I don't have a mic on and you guys are probably just getting blasted by uh, whoever's singing this song. So I'll try to talk loud. Red bean rice cakes. Red bean rice cakes. Okay, what else? Hai Chu is a must. I know what Hai Chu is. Hai Chu is just candy. It's pretty good. We can get some, yeah. Dried shrimp jerky. Dried, okay, so let's do dried shrimp jerky and then the, the cake. What was the cake? Okay. Red bean rice cake. Okay, red bean rice cake and shrimp jerky. Let's start with those two yep. and go from there. As we can find anything in the store, zero. Beef jerky, shrimp jerky. Let's let's feel this. Oh, what? Feel that. What's the strap there? What is that? Ew, I don't know if I like that. But this is jerky. The problem is I can't read any of this packaging. Can someone help? What does this say? Is that sh oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> we need shrimp jerky is what we've been told to buy. So look for shrimp. Here's shrimp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha 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 han Hanami, maybe. Shrimp jerky, bro. We gotta find it. It's gonna be, it, it's gonna be one of these. I just can't read a single lick of this. It's the problem. Just, I can't, I can't read any of it. We were told to get shrimp jerky, but it's not a thing, right? It's not. This isn't shrimp, but this is something. So we're just gonna get. We're gonna get wow. a bunch of this stuff. We got, we got a lot. We got, we're gonna be eating a lot of this food, and it's probably not gonna taste good. But it could. What if it's fire? Could be the strap. You never know. All right, so we got lots of um, something. Mystery jerky. We'll call it that. Perfect. What was the cake? Red bean. Red bean rice cake. How the odds they have that? Let's see. No. Clue. It's a Japanese mo moki. See. This is this is this is interesting stuff. We're gonna get it's like it's you can't even there's nothing to compare. It's just like no, it's its own thing. Yeah, you can't even believe it. Yeah. Yeah. Coconut flavor. Okay. And then coconut. Oh wow, looks like an actual cake. Only two flavor. Okay, that's awesome. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Is that what Ray was talking about? I thought a rice cake was a dry, like yeah. a rice crispy almost. Yeah. But like with not marshmallow. This is like a but it says rice cake. Coconut. Co I feel like yeah, coconut would be like good. Coconut. You don't like coconut? I love not coconut. Really? I love coconut. These are straight Have fire. you ever had this again? Yeah. You, you've never had it? No. Okay, so it's got like pulp in it, basically. Pulp bits. Yeah. We could just get like, unless they have more small ones. Like the best ones are going to be like this, like a mango. Yeah. Get a mango. Let's get one. Okay, we'll just get, yeah, a, a, we'll get a kegger and split it. They, these yeah. boys have never, I didn't, I didn't really know it was an Asian thing, to be honest. Like I get them at gas stations. Yeah. No, Rob, Rob's obsessed with these. Okay, one, one more thing. What else is on? I don't want to mispronounce this, but kimchi, kimchi? Oh no. Kimchi? That stuff is spicy. Yeah, that stuff is <laughs> so spicy. Why don't we look dude. for beef or lobster balls, maybe? Or yeah. we just we can just adventure. Let's just find something that looks weird. So we found some frozen egg rolls, which is not really anything interesting, I guess. Apple hand rolled egg. Yeah, let's get apple egg roll. Yeah, let's egg get roll. apple egg rolls. You can't go wrong with yeah, apple egg rolls. Last time we got lobster, we get crab this time. Oh, Clam. Those are no, those are the gooey uh, ducks. Yeah, gooey ducks. Uh, what is that? It looks like a wiener. <laughs> it does. It looks like, what is You ever see the video, the uh, Dirty Jobs? Yeah. With Mike Rowe? Yeah. Did you see that episode? Yeah. <laughs> he like pulls them out. They're like, they're clams with some big, big freaking wieners. You can't oh. do those, no way. No, no. Let's do it. No, Let's I don't. Let's do it. No. We're as much as you enjoy that. wieners in your mouth, I'm not about that life. Oh, we've got baby octopus, squid. Oh, only go squid. Oh. What is that? What the hell? What the heck is it? Cuttlefish. I don't want to cuddle with that. Why would I do that? Absolutely not. That looks like an octopus, bro. Bonds was trying to convince me that this cuddle, cuddlefish is the deal. I don't even know what it is. I don't even know how you cook that thing. Cook it. What do you think? Are you down with cuddle? I'm down to cuddle, yeah. I did not ask that question, but okay. <laughs> Good to know. All right. How You want two of these things? or? Sure. Oh, God. Same with saws, I called a miter saw. Band saw, it's a band, band saw. saw. Yeah. Band saw. I took shop class once. Why don't you just use a freaking band saw to fillet a catfish? You can talk to his girlfriend. Tell, tell her you're busy. I gotta go, okay? Tell her you're about to cuddle with some fish. My dad, bro. Oh. Sorry. How's it going? Alright, how are you doing? Uh, I need a uh, cuttlefish. Yeah. Uh, two. Yeah. No, cuddle. No, cuddle. Cuddlefish, not catfish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big one. Big ones. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, God. There's no way to settle. 
zero percent this is edible. Uh, and then uh, you get like four uh, four baby octopus. Uh, just four four individual ones. How do you, how do you, how do you cook that? that? No <laughs> idea. That's a good you, sign. You've never ate it. Maybe maybe fried. Oh, fried. I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I agree. That's good. That's plenty. No, sir. That's it. That's good. That's it. Oh, okay, four piece, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Four, four piece. Dollar sixty-five an octopus. Not bad. Cuttlefish was, cuttlefish was like twenty bucks. That was a dollar fifty. Yeah. What if octopus the strat? It's cheap. All right. Thank you very, thank much. Thank you very much. Have a good one. Shoo! All right, folks. I forgot to jump out of my truck, so I jumped out of the freezer instead. We're at Walmart. So on the drive, we were looking at recipes and how to clean them, and well, yeah, this is gonna be bad, I can tell you that much. But we have decided to do the classic fry. It, it's, it's safe bet, okay? We gotta make sure these things are thoroughly cooked. No one needs salmon vanilla. We're going to, uh, frying it makes me feel the best, as far as like making sure we kill all the bacteria and stuff, which we've already got a fryer. Don't need to buy that. Do you have flour? Cheap veggie oil. We need like two of these. Pretty okay. sure we have some, but. Okay, it's all right, just in case. Just in case. Here we go. Or, what if we got some seasoned stuff? That'd be better. What do you probably, think? Like a, chi like a chicken fry yeah, of like some right kind? Here. Chicken fry. There's fish, fish fry. fry. Yeah. You think fish fry? Seafood breading. It's just made for all things seafood. What do you think about that? Fish? Everything. Yeah. New Orleans style, so it's gonna, it'll be spicy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. We should do that. Okay, so we got that. Oh yeah, here we go. We're going organic or what? You, you, a, big jumbo? Ju you a big jumbo I'm white big guy? Jumbo. Let's see what these jumbo whites look like. They don't look too jumbo they look, to me. They look jumbo and white. I, I, I say they're gonna be good enough. What do you think? Those are pretty much keggers. Yeah, I would say. Yeah, that'll work. So we got egg wash, we've got veggie oil, fish fry, we have a fryer, we got everything else. That's that's pretty that's a pretty good Walmart trip. Tell you what, I would say it's it's, it's one of the better ones. We usually spend a lot more money here. Any 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 personal care items or anything? How about you, buddy? Uh, you don't use that, forgot. Alright, we're good. Oh god, this is gross. Oh, look at this thing. Oh, it's got ink. Oh god, the ink's getting everywhere. All the meat, I believe, is like this, right here. This little shell thing. So I'm actually gonna go back, I'm gonna watch this video. Alright, here we go. Flip it on its belly, okay? Take your scissors, you're gonna cut, right? Oh, okay. You grab this whole thing, okay? Oh, and then you rip it up. Got it. Oh wow, this is actually pretty easy, okay? Bonzo, you want this in your mouth? Yeah. Oh, there what you go. The... Look at that. Yeah, that's literally a bone. That's why they call it what, what? kind of what, what, cuddle? What? Cuddle. It's a cuddle bone. Yeah. So this is what's all meat. Oh god, look at this. Okay, yeah, let's get. Oh, oh god. Oh god, Rick, you just got oh. eat everywhere. Rick. Wow, this is an incredible moment. Okay, we're skinning it. Get the skin off. Nobody likes the skin. Now it looks a little more appetizing. Not bad. Mm. Not as bad as it was. Okay, I'm just gonna go with it. I don't know. I don't even know what that is, but that seems really tough. So we're not gonna eat that. So we've got two little fillets here. I think we should do strips. Just give it one of these. Just like that. There you go. You got your strips of meat. Throw them in there. You want to get all this ink off, I assume. Again, I talk like as if I know what I'm doing, but I'm just going off assumptions here that nobody likes ink. But this, this is the little french fries. I like that little analogy. So we're good with that. Um, I guess we do have octopus that we got to clean too. But that's that's all we're going to eat. We're not going to eat all their little string bean looking things. It's just, yeah, it just kind of freaks me out. I say we just go with the straight up meat and uh, let's figure out what we're going to do with these octopus looking things. Anyone have any ideas on? You cut the head off. Okay. You sure you cut that off? Yeah, I'm eating that. Yeah. You just want to fry that. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what you do. Really? Is there any guts in there? That's what I'm. I don't know. I mean, there's no guts here. It was. A, it would have been in the head. No, if that's, what, that's, that, that's what you so do. So you just fry this guy. Yeah. Okay. Throw him in. How much to eat this raw? How much? No chance. I'll, no chance. I'll Venmo you right no, now. He doesn't know. No chance. Five hundred dollars. Two hundred. Five hundred. Wait, did you Bro. just hear this kid? You offered five hundred. He goes two hundred, and you got a deal. Oh. Imagine that thing, like the suctions. Sucking onto your throat on the way down, oh and then just get stuck and you die. Okay, that was easy. I like the octopus. I'm, I'm a fan of the octopus just because it's a little bit easier to clean. Shoo! We got everything prepped. We got all of the cuttlefish cut up, octopus, and we've got the old batter, so seafood batter, eggs, and the oil is getting toasty. It's gonna take a little minute. So before we do that, we're gonna we're gonna get a little tasting going on. A little 
I mean, you guys have never had aloe, so that's good. Well, I'll try that. And then, I still don't know about this. I'm not eating that. You, that is a, you, I don't like coconut. What spoons? You don't like yeah, coconut? We need, sure. No, we need spoons, for sure. You don't like coconut, huh? I am not like a fan. Almond Joys, no? Nope. Really? Nope. I love coconut. So we're going to try some of this uh, mystery jerky. This will be our dessert. We'll throw this in the fryer, um, as well as the aloe. And you guys just get to sit back, relax, and enjoy our uh, our what, what, mukbang. That's what you call these things. A little Asian market mukbang round two. Look at your big mango guy. Huge mango guy. Let me see it. It smells just like mango. Imagine that. Wow. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> that. Mmm. Yeah. Salmon. Yeah. Mm. Let me know what you think. Oh, that's fire. Oh, you God, that's good. You get the pulp in it? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You give that a taste, buddy. Oh, God. It's good. Dude. And it's got it's oh, okay. chunks. It's, it's good. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. And it was, it's not even like cold. Where's this been my whole life? Yeah, I know. No, it's just like it's just like good for you. Really? I don't know. Rob, Rob's obsessed with it. Yeah, so it's, it's got crunchy pulp bits. Yeah, that's good. Fire, huh? Yeah. Cool. On like a super hot day. Yeah. yeah. It'd be it'd be game changing. Cool. I just have a really bad feeling about all this mystery. Oh. Oh, oh it's that, I don't like that. Does not look the same. No. This is dog food. It's individually yeah. packed. This is dog food. Just give it a nipski. Cheers, boys. Cheers to mystery meat. Oh, I, mine just dropped on me. Oh. Okay, okay. Oh, God. <laughs> nope. Nope. I can't. I got it. It's good. It's I can't. Good. It's good. <laughs> Shut up. No, it's not. It's the thought of it being dog food. It could be dog food. Oh, no. Worse? Tell me what you guys think. What? No. Why does anybody eat this? What is I think this, I'm a, I'm dude? Like you. This is spicy, I think. Oh, no. This is bad. Oh, it's hot. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. I'm not. Oh, it's God. super spicy. I'm not. Super spicy. <laughs> Dude, I, I dab my I tongue on it. I'm not. I dab my tongue, my Dude. tongue's on fire. I smell that. Lick it. Your tongue will light Oh, I do. Oh, oh. It's so bad. I don't know how you do it. Oh, wow, shocker. More individually packed dog food. Why does that come out like that? Does it not smell like beef? <laughs> Think of the factories that these come out of. I hope that didn't even get in your mouth. How is it? Ah, it's bad beef drippy. <clears throat> Definitely not American beef jerky. No. Here's your mystery meat on a stick, my friend. Ooh. No, not good? Yeah. Really? Dude, it smells like a soft plastic. <laughs> Doesn't it? It smells like Guggenbait. It smells like Guggenbait. Like mondo dude. worm. Dude, it smells like a it's, Mondo worm. It does smell like, exactly like a Mondo worm. It does. It does. It is that, like am I wrong? Bait. No, it smells like Guggenbait. I think Mondo worm would taste better than this. Please tell me this is better. What is that? Is it spongy? What in the... Oh, that is it. I don't know if you're supposed to, like, cook this or something. <laughs> Dude, this isn't edible. No way. Oh, I got it, I got it. Is it frozen? What the? No way this is the actual... It's just, there's no flavor. Are you sure I'm not eating the plastic? These might be good. No, they're probably not gonna be. Yeah, just, that's just, no, that's just, just, just for the yeah, no. 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 Don't get no. your hopes up. I mean, it's not like super sweet. That's alright. It's made out of rice. This is, it's like the dough. Yeah, it's right. It's interesting. <laughs> oh god, look at this fish. <laughs> Not good or what? I don't know what it tastes like. <laughs> it tastes like nothing. Alright, here we go. Ugh, it smells like fish. So we're gonna give it a little egg wash, okay? Then it goes into the breading mix. You wanna make sure these are covered nice and thorough. And I'm honestly, I, I'm, I'm feeling a double dunk, TBH. Just a, d a double dunkage like that. Then you go back. Just make sure we got a nice, good coating. And take it, throw it in the fryer, and uh, we'll see how they taste. Oh yeah. We got them all double dunked in the fryer. I think they'll be all right. I think once they start floating, they'll be done. Then we're gonna move on to uh, Big Chungus Octopus. Literally, a whole freaking octopus. Get the grease off. Look at my little french fries. Look at those things. They actually look good. Here you go, Hook Daddy. A little ketchup action on there. Oh, yeah. Tartar sauce or something. All right, so those are done. Let them cool off. Now it's time to fry whole octopus. So let's see how this is going to go. Light dusting, just a, just a little flip-flop action like that. And then you take them and give them a dangle in the egg. Just like that. Put them back in this. There you go, yeah, give them a good dunking. 
back in here. Give it one of these guys. Take him over, give him a dangle. A little bubble bath for a few minutes, y'all steamed up. And uh, we're ready to eat. Almost forgot before we get to eating, we gotta get these guys in the, in the grease. Have you ever seen a better crispy egg roll? Egg roll? I've never yeah. heard of apple egg roll. You acted like it was a normal thing. I just assumed it'd be like an apple turnover or some kind. Okay. I but like I've, we've never had them. I've not had them. But we've got these to try. Um, are we going after yeah, we'll go the, the fries first. first? All right. Cheers, boys. To uh, what's this thing called? No oh. seasoning. Cuttlefish. Oh, that's fire. Oh yeah. Tastes like all right. It's like texture's like rubber, but tastes good. Now texture sucks. It doesn't taste that bad, though. No, the seasoning on the outside is good. I mean, it's definitely better than I thought it'd be. You could make them even thin. You could slice it even thinner, too. Yeah. You know? Yeah. We want it to be less chewy. That's not bad. It's not nearly as chewy as I thought. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Diet. Let's get Zion over him. Baby octopus is not nearly as chewy. That's pretty good. I would say it's pretty good. Baby octopus is better than 100%. Cuttlefish. Honestly, baby octopus, pretty good. Like, it's just the cuttlefish was a little rubbery, a little dense. The texture for of the us. cuttlefish is really good. And weird. the texture of the cuttlefish could have maybe been better if I cooked it longer or less or whatever, but the flavor's good. I would definitely say the octopus is better. So, for the grand finale. Did you eat it? Oh. Mm -mm. Oh, it's hot. Okay. Oh, yeah. Is it good? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's hot. It's crispy on the outside. Oh, good, bro. Dude, that's good. Crispy on the outside, and then it just tastes mm. like dude. Pie. Do I not apple pie. pie. It's like apple pie. It's like apple pie. Out of all the things we bought in eight, I would say this guy probably the most Americanized thing that we bought. I wouldn't say Americanized, but more what we're used to. Definitely the best octopus. That was the most surprising. Yeah, this. Yeah, definitely octopus is pretty good. Cuttlefish, not as bad as I thought. Like none of it was bad. Well, all the appetizers, every freaking one of them Gross. sucked. Even the little desserts kind of sucked. Um. But as far as the main course, it really wasn't that bad. It's just kind of a texture thing with the cuttlefish, but the, so the octopus is pretty good. But these things right here, we need to make these a normal thing. They need to serve these at restaurants. Maybe they do. Nowhere around here. But I would say definitely the best part of the meal. Well, folks, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode. Something a little bit different. It's something that we already kind of did with the lobster. We went and bought a bunch of food, had a mukbang. Ate the lobster. It was pretty good. This was a little bit more on the exotic side, I would say. You know, we got some cuttlefish. We got some, uh, I guess, lop, right, octopus. The only other thing that was there that I would want to do, two things. Maybe a big squid. They had some kegger squid. And a crab. I love crab, and I, I've never cooked one before, so maybe next time we'll do a little crab competition of some kind. A little cook-off. Crab cook-off. How about that? But... If you guys enjoyed kind of the little bit different, more laid back videos where, you know, we're just running around town buying food, cooking food, and eating food, a little mukbang style. If you guys enjoy these videos, let me know and also give us some more ideas in the comment section down below. Maybe we don't go to the Asian market, maybe we go to a different market, or maybe we just go to Walmart and buy food. If there's any food that you want to see us catch, clean, cook, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching, and peace. Mm -hmm.